right here. Is that Pedro? This week, we're coming at you from the launch event for The Mandalorian Season 3. So good to see you. So good to see you, too. How excited are you to share Season 3 with the fans tonight? It's amazing. We've waited long enough. It's going to be a wild ride, and I can't wait for all of the hard work to be shared with everybody. I'm just so excited. This has been a long wait, and it's finally here, and everyone is just, I am just so excited for everyone to see it. It's about time, okay? We've all been working, 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 and this eagerness to see it finally come to the screen, and here we are tonight. You should be here with us. Why are you sitting at home or wherever you're sitting? You should be here with us. I don't think the whole internet was invited. Why didn't we invite everybody? on the internet. Okay, demand that you're invited to the next one. I'm telling you now. When you buy somebody a birthday present and you want to see them open it up, that's what it's felt like for the last like two years. Because I'm a fan myself. I've just been like, ah, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'll be honest, like the first two seasons, I think it's hard to put a finger on who exactly Dr. Pershing is. And so season three, I think a lot of those questions are going to get answered. We're going to get to know him. And I got to know him a lot better as well. Having gotten to see the entirety of the story for season one and having had the experience of hearing from the fans how this character resonated with them. When I came back to do season three, I just felt so much more comfortable. I've loved it this season because it always feels like it's a new exploration. The writing is so good by Dave Filoni and especially Jon Favreau that it gives you something new to look forward to as an actor. It's never the same. It's obviously a show that means a lot to a lot of people. They haven't had these two characters together for a while, so I think it's great for everyone that they're back. And John always, his writing's explosive, let's just say that in a word. It's going to start with a bang. It's such a treat to see it with a crowd. We've been building up to a lot of things, and now uh, those things are going to play out. We've been working at it for a long time, so it's great that we're going to have a couple weeks of fun here for the people who made it. I'm really excited because I, I really feel like this season raises the bar on what kinds of stories John and Dave are telling with the series, and it goes deeper into the Star Wars mythos. It's, it's really yeah. something special. Visually in, in itself, season three is so rich. It's just such a treat because I think Star Wars needs that spectacle and it needs that fun. And Mando 3 is going to deliver. We did elevate. We did take it a little bit slower this time and make better decisions, I think. My crew and I are just huge fans of the show. You want to make sure that the fandom is honored, and so you don't want to take any shortcuts. It's got to be surreal for you to have your name join a list that includes John Williams, as well as Ludwig and so many other amazing composers. I'll be honest, like you're kind of choking me up right now because it's like I've worshipped Star Wars for so long. The music is something that brought me into it. <laughs> It is a very, very busy, awesome, amazing season filled with lots of sound, certainly, yeah. and a lot of lot of other great things. I mean, incredible performances and characters. Got a lot of voices that we've put in the show. That yeah. we, that's, we probably can't talk about a lot of that. Roger, Roger. I just want to see the dad and the son again, yes. you know, and then all the Mandos, like, just, like, yes. duking it out. We couldn't be more proud of the work we've done and, and the entire team that put this season together, so I can't wait. I think we got a lot to get excited for, and I'm just excited like every other Star Wars fan there is in the universe. More Star Wars is better. Thanks for everything you guys do for the franchise and we really appreciate it as fans. All right, that's it for this week. Watch The Mandalorian Season 3 right now on Disney Plus and be sure to join us right here every Thursday for This Week in Star Wars. Thanks for watching. May the Force be with you.